Uh, ladies and gentlemen, it's uh, another tragedy in the world of pop and R&B uh, and a little bit of hip hop, I guess. Uh, look like Omarion and Lil Fizz, you know, back at it again. They're going, you know, back and forth. Uh, I don't know, you know, who said anything first, but the look like Omarion said, hey, never let lame-ish make you do lame-ish. And Lil Fizz... The ever watching, ever responding young man that he is said, hey, you know, if the shoe fits, then buy two pair. Lame, a expletive. Um, guys, let me just step in as a, as a, as a, another superstar. Maybe my words would be a little bit more impactful. Um. You know, it's obvious that you all have lost the real reason as to why, you know, you've been so blessed. You guys um, have fallen out so, so much. I mean, y'all supposed to be brothers. And now all of a sudden, you, you know, April has, it's, she's gone. She's, you know what I mean? It, it, April has, has, you know. Well, let me just say, Fizz, you ain't got no business to call nobody lame. What you did with April was lame as hell. And then, you know, uh, then Omarion, this, you know, you shouldn't say nothing about no lame stuff because after we saw the, the versus battle, that's just it. You know what I'm saying? Um, Lil Saint is in heaven right now denying that he knows any of y'all. All of us are disappointed. Y'all just need to get it together. I don't know what, you know what I mean? If you can't be cordial with one another, just don't say nothing. You don't have to say anything or respond. You know what I'm saying? Lil Saint is pretending that he don't even know who B2K is. He telling everybody he used to be on the road with the drifters. He don't want to know y'all. So... You think on that. 